I'm Joe Inwood, I'm the BBC senior film producer, formerly of the Near East and now moved to Africa. Um, I've been working with BBC for so it's going off now we are. Absolute amateur. Unfortunately, I've been working I've been working in broadcast journalism for thirteen years but don't remember to switch my phone off before being interviewed. All the BBC thinks this, the BBC thinks that, or the BBC's bias. The BBC the bias the BBC has is of its thank you very much. Thank you, that's great. Of its eighteen thousand thank you. Individual employees. I remember when we first started, first started talking about 360, they were like, oh, you're going to the press conference, can you take a 360 camera? Well, no, of course, when you can retrospect, like, that's a really stupid thing to do. If someone has decided that they're planting cockroaches, let them all drown, there's no way that I could ever, even with the most pathetic video ever made, change someone's mind on that. So I'll sit there on the tube, oh, where's, where have all my bags gone? You know, there are, like, practical limitations, there are practical problems with these things. But that, I guess that means that we don't create quick new content. If the subject is a good storyteller, then that's the best way. If you've got a great engaging presenter, they're going to empathise and, and, you know, actually tell the person's story better than they can, that's the best way. The question I ask myself with 360 every single time is, is it worth it? Because that's, that's the, it's, it's basically, you could always, in, in many ways, Traditional camera is a much better way to tell a story. 